Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome back to RimWorld. Let's continue our uh, sea ice challenge. Our moat is slowly being built, but right now we have mostly this problem over here that we have to deal with. So, before everyone breaks, let's uh, squat up, boys. Problem over here is also that uh, whatever comes out of here is definitely going to outrange most of us. So that is a problem. Wouldn't you agree? Hey Frank, you can be our tank. Okay, Midstorm fired us. Have you been? Did you did I did I reconnect you? I did not. Get reconnected, son. Okay. Not too bad. Uh you can shoot whatever you want now. You can shoot whatever you want. Can you shoot at the cider? No. Yes. Now you can. Be careful, Frank. Be careful. Oh, wow. The turret is outranged. <laughs> oh, this is so bad. Okay. What we're gonna do is we're gonna reinstall the turret. Well, we can't reinstall it anywhere that would really get in range. Here, maybe. Robert, work on us. Okay, Leslie, can you shoot at this thing? Please. Let's get rid of that thing first. Thank you. Go over here. Don't tell me you can't shoot at the centipede. Because I'm gonna be extremely mad. Oh my god. Oh, you are so useless. This is very bad for us right now. I have done this completely wrong. Oh well, uh, let's do this. Bobbert, work on this for me. At least this is this is gonna die before... yeah, but don't, don't even do it. Don't even do it. I forgot it's made of lead and thusly not useful. Who has the animals? Who can release the animals? Are you... Frank, are you not... Uh, Thought to be released yet? Of course not. Okay, so two people are shooting at this guy. No one has hit it yet. Frank is probably gonna die and we're gonna eat Frank, which is fine. Like, this is extremely bad what I'm gonna do. Don't do this at home, boys. Don't do this at home. Go, Frank. Go, Frank. Don't do this at home, because you will die, and probably my own people will die as well. But I want Bobber to be able to shoot. Well, ISMS, you're going in there. Nice one, that guy's down. I'm not afraid of you, Centipede. So, that's why I'm falling back. We can outrange you with uh, the snipers, and uh, deal with you easier. I'm not afraid of what you have to offer. Really not. Although Bobbert would be the one that really should go out there and try shooting stuff. ISMS, how badly are you hurt? Oh, you are badly hurt. Shot in the heart. Shot in the heart. And the centipede is to blame. You give love a bad name. You guys should really just go away. Really, you don't have anything to do over here, so just go away. And you guys take care of this. Don't care about item stash opportunity. Leslie, you might want to move. Actually, let's move you over here. It's better that you guys are spread out a bit. Isom is going to come over here. Yay Bones is going to attend to you. Okay, he's shooting at Leslie. Okay, Yay Bones. Uh, Isomess, are you getting the perfect meds? You are. Yay Bones, please tend to Isomess before Isomess dies because Isomess got shot in the heart. Okay, we can deal with us. Midstorm and Leslie gonna deal with us. I think uh, putting ISMS in danger there was fine because thusly we got uh, Bobbert close enough and he could use his pistol to just destroy this guy. Yeah, you can see this. You can see this. Good, good, good. Okay, you will need to be dealt with. 
how are you doing? Getting tended to? Yes. Okay, you guys really should start taking care of us now. Yes. Good job. Good job. Nothing terrible happened. I missed click right now, but nothing terrible happened. You're neutral, so you're gonna come here and you're gonna melt this thing to death. So we can get rid of it. Hold us back in. And... You know what? Over here we can put uh, mechanoid corpses. So they will be roofed. I would like that, yes. It's gonna take you a while to destroy this, I realize that, but... Uh, Midstorm, I know you can enjoy uh, some time out there. Yeah, the sand is getting snowed over. Look at all this dirt. All this dirt! <laughs> Imagine how many bricks that's gonna be. I can tell you, it's gonna be plenty of bricks. Uh, I need someone to go repair this. And then we can uninstall it and reinstall it somewhere else. Thank you, Midstorm. Thank you very much. We also have uh, some extra steel from that. And the Militia say a Persona Core. It's not actually deteriorating out here, so that's good. This guy should be taken care of soon. But ISMS needs to heal up first. Then she can uh, destroy them. Nice. Nicely done. This was nicely done. And we are getting more of this up here. ISMS fully healed. Thank you very much. Comms console broke down. You are not making clay right now. You are modifying the cider, you're modifying the centipede, so they don't wake up. Don't want them repairing themselves. Nope, nope, nope. Don't want them repairing themselves. Very nice. We're getting cider blades that we can sell. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Modify this thing. I'll forbid that thing. Boom. Okay. Uh, I would like... Some stuff to be hauled urgently over here though, because this thing is going to deteriorate and we must not have them deteriorating because they are useful to us. Yes, I want this to be repaired so we can use it again. How's the power right now? The power is fine. There's a trade ship coming by, exotic goods trader. ISMS. Do you need sleep? You don't really need sleep. Let's uh, have you talk to the exotic goods trader. Uh, I don't want to sell Frank. Hopefully they healed up Frank. Forgot to check that. There's nothing I can sell you, huh? Ooh, I think you would buy this things, though. Yep, Bobbert. Hollis, Leslie. You're tending to yay buns. Okay, Midstorm, Hollis. Those things we can sell, and those things are going to give us money. So yes, please hold them in. One in. The other one's gonna be in right now. ISMS, go call those guys. Yes, Cider Blades. 1400 monies. Boom. Lovely. Let's go. That's the money we needed. To, I don't know. In future, I'm sure we're gonna need it. We can buy good stuff with it. Materials, resources, whatever. You name it. Although bricks are going to be like our main resource from now on, basically. Since our deep water moat is going to be done somewhere in next year, hopefully. Until then, we will be quite defenseless. Which is a problem. I think you will get lots of XP from actually doing this. Let's see. How much XP do you get from this? Oh yeah, look at... He is learning quite fast. Oh, learning max today? What? Really? You can only learn 4k on the 100%, 150%, and then uh, less? Or something? Is that it? I don't understand this, I've never seen this before. I don't know. He's learning fast, and that's the important part. <clears throat> and also getting us more dirt, that we can turn into more clay, that we can turn into more bricks. It's basically what it comes down to. Yeah. Making clay out of uh, dirt. Beautiful. Three dirt into five clay. What if... Piles of sand. No, wait, what? 
Now this is dirt. Make five clay out of piles of sand. Mm. Now I was hoping you could do like convert, uh, I don't know, nine dirt into 15 clay or something like that so you could uh, do it faster. But I guess there's nothing like that over here. Which is also fine. Which is also fine. Just 65 clay. What? Uh, 24 bricks is 2 clay? Yep. <laughs> oh, imagine how many bricks we're gonna have soon. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I like it. I like it. You're gonna. Now, basically, this is our resources for building materials are basically saved now. Not gonna have any more problems. Nope. This is it. What did you catch? Seven crayfish. Hold them in. Because, uh, hold them in. Right? This takes so slow, though. So slow. <laughs> I need more constructors to do this. Basically, I can't really construct anything else while we do this. That's how it is. Uh, actually, a question. Can we make a turret out of bricks? No. I am gonna make another steel turret, though, just, just because we, we can use it. We can use it. Maybe even two. I realize that's a lot of our steel, but uh, I think we need them. We will get attacked more and more, so uh, yeah. We can't always um, just rely on our firepower. So we'll have to make this. We'll have to make it happen. Bobbert's growing more rice. We are actually nice on food right now. That means I am I am open to recruiting more people. Yeah, I'm open to recruiting more people, basically. Uh, black steel and plastic, nice. Carpet making is next. We've been researching a lot of just stuff. We can't really do deep drilling. Mm. Synth thread. Uh, sure. I'm gonna unlock synth thread. That seems nice to me. Finding mortars, great bows. We could go for uh, refining and mortars, so we can uh, save ourselves from uh, sieges later on. Although the perfect way to deal with us is just to have a siege attack you, and you go there and you shoot them, and then you take your their stuff. <laughs> that is the perfect. Thing. So you have to wait for them to actually build the mortars, then you can just steal them and reinstall them. And it's perfect. We don't have a machinery to actually d destroy those guys. So that's unfortunate. Uh, right, Exotic Goods Trader maybe had uh, gold earlier. We need to buy gold. Let's actually see. Uh, this one is 20, right? What about this one? Is 30 so basically need 50 gold and we do have the 50 plus steel so 50 gold we need to buy I don't know if we have enough money for that but um, yeah that's that's what we have to do basically that's what we gonna do and capacity refugee do you do do you think we look like people that we can go and save people people that can save people no no, excuse me, we're not people saving people. Just just not the way it is. Deep water, ho ho. <laughs> it's happening extremely slowly. And everyone's breaking while they do it. They don't like the cook cannibalism for some reason. Grimy, yeah, we'll we'll build you stuff eventually, don't you worry about it. But this is a priority now. This is a priority. You know what we're gonna do? I am gonna go over here. I'm gonna delete half of the zone. Because right now we're quite fine on food, right? I'm gonna build this over here. Okay, yeah, I did it proper. Okay, you! No, shit! Forgot! We don't have anyone who has eight growing, right? So we can't grow uh, medicine. Stupid, stupid, stupid. But you know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna put corn over there. So it might take a long while to grow, but it's gonna be very useful later on. And that's the thing we want. 
That's the thing we want. Do they still eat the raw crayfish? I don't know. I mean, it can be eaten raw, so that's good. Dirt is also not deteriorating, so that's good. It's 115 dirt. So it's like uh, 3 dirt into 5 clay, right? You know what? That's too much for me. We have 140 clay already. Wow. Let's start making some bricks, yo. Let's uh, turn you off for a bit. There you go. There you go, ISMS. Start making me bricks now. It might take you a while, but uh, let's start making bricks. Yeah, it takes a while. Do you get any XP from this? I need to know. Very slow XP, but you get XP. So that's important. That's the important part. Since you're going to be making a lot of bricks, that's going to be good. We can already make thousands of bricks, basically. It's storm? Is it anxiety? It is anxiety again. Just plus 1% on the mental break threshold. But you do break quite a lot. Because, you know, all of this. <laughs> all of this. Go take a poop or whatever you want to do. Take a pee or something. Oh, our bathroom. Poor bathroom. It's not a good bathroom. Far, Very far from it. Very, very far from it. <laughs> yeah, well. What can you do, right? So, I'm thinking about 50 episodes down the line, we'll actually build this moat. That's important. This is thick snow as well on the ice. I like it how it says that some resources have been wasted. But you can't waste resources if you just, you know, do this. Where is he? What's wrong with you? You do like tossing. You're in pain, huh? Because of the sensory mechanites. Right. Forgot about that. Forgot about that. How's the temperatures? Doing fine. Doing fine. Oh, you're trying to teach Frank. Oh, Frank can be released now. Hey, oh, hell yeah, Frank. Oh, he has a gunshot already. Well, Frank is gonna be a combat animal now. Definitely, Frank, definitely. I'm actually gonna give ISMS, who is a good shot, I'm gonna give her this rifle. Why, you ask? Well, this is way too close, right? And we will be benefiting from long range rifle, especially since we can have uh, people running around here and we can have a barrier around here that where we can just shoot them. Psychic suit, that is perfect for us. Maybe those extreme breakers are gonna go for uh, away for a while. Alright. Cargo pots, don't mind if I do. What is this? Eel corpses? 38 eel corpses. Damn. <laughs> well then. Food is food. I'm not complaining. Yeah, go for it, boys and girls, of course. Also, for everyone that wanted to be named into this colony, for now I apologize because I'm not taking too many people in, but uh, you must see why that is happening. Because we, we can't really we can't really deal with this. Ooh, each one of these gives you how much? Fish stuff? Do doesn't look like too much. Nine? Yeah, nine-ish. Okay, that's good, but we also get eel skin. So yeah, I, I apologize because I'm not naming people right now. I mean, I named the ones that we have, but I can't really get new people right now. Due to the fact that, uh, yeah, we, we couldn't feed them. Now we probably can feed them. We are quite fine on food. Look at the amounts of meat we have. So we're quite fine on food. And uh, since we don't have the volcanic winter and such that we had last year. Right? There's a slaver approaching. Well talk about it uh, I might actually buy a slave from those guys if they have a good slave I might actually do it no I'm not gonna buy it um, I, I said I want to save my uh, I want to save my money for gold so yeah no nope, not gonna do it <laughs> we're gonna wait for someone there's gonna be people coming I, I know they're gonna be coming hey slavers how's it going 
Uh, let's actually put a trading spot. Trading spot like over here. You can be over there. And ISMS is gonna go talk with uh, Borba. Where the hell are you going, guys? Oh, down here. No, no, no. Trading spot is go up here. So they have two people. A bear man with asthma. Seven growing and passionate. Ooh, we do need a grower. And Minoka, the wolf man. Not at growing. Nothing at growing. Nudist, yeah, perfect. I am very, very tempted to buy Gabella the healer. He's also good at medicine. Passionate about construction. Passionate about growing. I have to do this, right? I have to do this. We have to get someone that can grow for us. What is your gear like? Uh, I can I can actually check that over here. Where is Gabella? That's you. Gear. Took. Travel wear and parka. Polar bear skin parka. So you can go minus 6 to 6. So that is quite good, actually. Trade with them again. We are gonna buy Gabella. Yeah. I'm not selling Frank. We're buying Gabella. Hey, Gabella! Welcome to the colony. So you are a male person. And you are gonna be well doctoring is up there for you as well you are my main grower now which means that bobber doesn't need to do too much growing anymore actually we're gonna just let you uh, that number one I can uh, put you guys up farther probably let's put you down on two as well so yeah uh, Gabella number one growing plant guarding and then you can do the rest as well. Hauling. You can fish if you need to. Didn't check how good are you at shooting. Oh, zero. Well, at least you can shoot. I'm gonna give you a rebel pistol. And we gonna make this non-medical. You can, of course, go to sleep right away. Because why not? You can be a day person. Gabella. And uh, I should go and rename you. I uh, should go and rename you. So let's see who do we have next on the list. That would be Cannon. Let's rename you to Cannon then. Not Canoy. Cannon! Welcome to Colony Cannon. Hopefully you will enjoy your stay as being a uh, Bearman healer. Why are things broken over here? What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? Stop destroying my stuff. Whatever you're doing. Fire? Oh, there was a fire in here, I guess. They set this on fire? <laughs> That's weird. But oh well. It's a cannon. Hauling piles of dirt right now. Okay, carpet making is done. We're gonna go devil strand and stuff. Ooh, we are actually full on meat over here? Really? Ah, that stockpile should not be like this. I never thought we we're gonna have so much meat that this is gonna ever be full. <laughs> but uh, look at this now. Look at the amounts of fish meat we have. Really a lot. I like it. I like it very much. Also, we're gonna get rice soon. And after we get this rice, yeah, 100% grown. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna delete this part of the zone. That should be perfect. Yeah. And we're gonna make our own ground zone. Like this. And please, please. Just click on this one and this one. Right, he still has not. He's not skilled enough. I'm, I'm stupid. Why am I doing this to myself? He's not skilled enough. He has seven. And passion. So no, we have to let him uh, level up first. Traders are leaving. That's fine. Cannon, you have to do this for me. Get that rice for me. Yeah. The rice is resting for now. What are you butchering still? There's more eels? Damn. 
There's more eels, yeah? What can I say? Those eel eels are nice. Very nice eels. How much uh, eel skin did we get out of this? 150. Eel skin is also very nice. So we'll, we'll have to do some clothing. Let's check. I mean, everyone is pretty good on clothing right now. Yeah. I think Bobbert with minus 48 is the least. So I want a shirt and pants for you. The rest do have shirts and pants, right? Yeah. So we'll make shirts and pants. We do have this thing, right? Okay, so let's make me pants and let's make me a button-down t-shirt. Boom. We have 400 bricks. Lovely. Hopefully ISMS is gonna work on the tailoring first. Should. She should. Hey, you guys. Oh, you Lynxman? I think you're a Lynxman, aren't you? That's nice. We also have some steel down here. Yeah, we're kind of low on steel, but that's going to be great. Well, this is happening. Well, this side is not happening, but otherwise it's happening. <laughs> and this side happened quite a lot. But mostly they're focusing on the bottom. Which is also fine with me. Look at the amounts of dirt we have out here. That's going to be great for us. It's going to be great for us. We don't even need to eat human meat, but I am going to eat human meat because... You know what? Why not? There you go. ISMS making us a muffle leather pants. And Cannon can equip us. Cannon is slowly growing. Hopefully leveling up. Oh yeah. Very close actually. Very close to being level 8. And then uh, I can do the thing over here. That's fine. I'm, let, I'm gonna let you grow. Gonna let you grow. Gonna let you grow. And you're gonna haul some eel skin. That's fine. Look at the amounts of meat we have. Beautiful. Devil's Trend done. I, I'm i not going to be growing Devil's Trend yet. Pants have been made. There's actually excellent muffled leather pants. It's really nice. Someone's going to definitely put them on. I don't know who, but someone's going to do it. And a muffled leather t-shirt. Okay. So Cannon can then equip those. Uh, those ones are Orion ones, huh? Those ones are excellent as well. Well, Cannon can wear those. ISMS now needs warm clothing. Hmm. This ones were probably better for uh, cold, huh? Yeah, much better. Alrighty then. It is to be expected. T-shirt has been done. So hopefully Cannon is going to equip us. This is probably... Oh, that's minus 10 for cloth. So yeah, it's actually better. There's a bass corpse, huh? Would you put the bass in there? Don't put fish corpses in here, yo. Actually, I guess you can put the fish corpses in there, although I'd prefer if they were put down here. But I also realized that this might be completely full, so um, if nothing else, we can put meat over here. Right, I don't want meat to be put over here. Someone did put those things on. Cannon's running for mayor of... Oh! What mod is this from? What mod is this from? Wait. So, uh, Midstorm. We need greater support for free speech. <laughs> this colony is headed for disaster. I will solve our problems. The mayor shouldn't meddle in the private affairs of colonies. We, we need to address what's happened in the present. This colony is on the right track. We can create a bright future. Everyone's our colony should be able to succeed. As mayor, I'll get things done. Things are good, but they could be better. I like, uh, I like uh, what Cannon is saying. Much more than what Midstorm is saying. I have no idea what this... Uh, what mod is this from? No idea. <laughs> no idea whatsoever, but I like it. I like it very much. I don't have like the colony leadership. I don't have that mod on. That never worked when I had tried to have it work. And I, I haven't used it in Alpha 18 at all, so definitely not that mod. I have no idea what this is from, but I like it very much. 
get me mayors and hopefully it's gonna be canon do you have uh, this in oh is this from uh, psychic stuff not psychic but psych might be I don't know could be maybe let's actually check lots of people have tethered apparel yeah you have pants that are tethered you will soon have pants that are tethered armor wests force duke this is uh, bad as well yeah we'll make some more t-shirts and more pants so make this happen isms i mean we have 500 bricks so we're pretty good on that soon oh election is here hmm. okay okay i like that i like the idea of the selection stuff Canon, are you level 8? Yes, Canon is level 8. Beautiful, Canon. So, what we're gonna do? We're gonna go and do the thing I wanted to do like a couple of times now. <laughs> and we're gonna do this. Boom. Select this. And don't make potato, make heal root. Let's go. Okay, with that, I'm gonna finish the episode. For now, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please consider dropping a comment down below. Should I like, subscribe and see more Do magic? And I'll see you next time. Kakarot.